Hello, hello, hello. It is Tara Plantagenet. Or into the Tara or Shamrock Kelly or whatever you want to call me. I even heard worse, trust me. And I probably will after this video. Because, well, I think there's an epidemic. I really do. I think there's an epidemic. Um, I hate to say this, I'm so sorry, okay, but it's the truth. Anyone with a phone, anyone that can download an app, lately thinks they're psychic. Do you know, years and years and years ago, like 15 years ago, I started reading pictures. People were like, well, what the hell, weirdo? Like. Okay, for one, when you're psychic, people think that you sacrifice animals, that you worship the devil, that you are at home in your cauldron whipping up some spells or whatever they do. I don't know. If you're a witch, hey, that's your thing. I'm not. The first thing people do is they send you... Bible verses and then they tell you what a bad person you are and that the Bible tells you that they're not supposed to believe in you and that it's against their beliefs because the Bible says which is really weird because okay for one like 80% of the psychics aren't motherfucking psychic those are my test words for the time they're not. They're like, I mean, okay, that's fun. It's fun for entertainment. It's fun. People like to, you know, get clarification. But when you're straight up showing up places like a crime scene, an active crime scene with your freaking app, trying to butt in to, okay, I think we know who we're talking about. Not to be rude, but police departments, they don't usually use psychics because it's inadmissible to court. They cannot, they just can't. And plus, that's like the last resort. And if they do, they never say anything. They're not like, hey, go out there and find that girl. and. And post it all over your Facebook and have live chats and go to all the like go bug all the neighbors like what the hell are you doing you are that crazy friend not even friend you are the person that overheard that girl was having a party okay and you were invited and you brought all your friends and then you're like no I was invited they invited me here Bro. Bro. You don't need to be psychic to see your bullshit, okay? A little backstory on me. I'm old, I won't say how old, but I grew up with a father who was a sheriff. He was a detective. I grew up around, you know, things and uh, I know right away when you're like, I got a clue, I'm going to call the tip line. And you're like, hi, I'm a psychic and I just got this clue. Summer came through and she's telling me, dude, the first thing they do is they write down quack. And they're like, they, most time they don't look at it. Most, they don't, I'm sorry, they can say they do, but no. You know how many psychics are calling in with tips? Are you serious, you guys? I mean, what do you, I don't get what people are trying to do. Like, that Juanita lady, okay, her daughter was like all acting like it was her biggest fan or something, and then trying to get money, it's like, 
let's find who we're looking for. I mean, the focus should be on Summer, right? I should be bringing her home alive, right? I don't know what everyone's doing with getting a hold of these people in town and seriously recording them and then freaking making videos about it. I mean, you're not reporters, you're not detectives. You're a YouTube wannabe psychic. I'm sorry, that's harsh. And I'm gonna get hate, I know I am, it's fine. It's fine, because not to be rude, I, I watch cards, readings and stuff, but it's, it's like, oh, okay, cool, maybe that'll happen. But not to be mean, it doesn't take a gifted person. I mean, actually, okay. There is this one. There's a couple that are pretty good. Like, um, Dot, oh my God. Uh, Jab oh God, what's her name? Some Jabba Ali, and oh God, Jojo, oh God, I forget. But she's pretty good, actually. The cards like fly out, but about 80%. I don't, I don't get it. Okay, for one, when when somebody's offering a five dollar palm reading, that's red flag. Okay, when they have a expensive shop down by the beach or like in downtown somewhere, like you know, and you walk in and there's little there's candles in there, you know, like three hundred dollars. Because, you know, you have a demon or some shit. They'll tell you whatever you want to hear. And it's, I just don't get how these people can live with themselves. Okay, so those aren't, those aren't psychics when... Okay. You yourself are the tool. Right? You shouldn't have to use things. You shouldn't have to, I mean, people like to have clarification, but when that's your main go-to, you might need to reevaluate things because all I know is it took me a long time to come out and to be honest because I was afraid of being made fun of. Because people are freaking mean. They are. But be genuine. Be honest. Be truthful. Don't use this stupid... Come on, dude. Come on. You actually are, like, using... <sighs> okay. You can get in a big trouble if you're, like, messing with people's crime scenes and stuff. I'm just saying, you can't just go waltzing it wherever you want. Because, like, do you notice how there's, like, so many Equus search people? Because they go through training. They go through vigorous training, and they are certified. They're not just going to let any freaking whoever, here, here, take a horse or whatever, let's go. Like, are you serious? Are you serious? Because if they go and they check somewhere, and then later, that's where they find somebody. I don't want to do that. <sighs> but you know, I have to I have to be on Don's side for that because I wouldn't <laughs> oh, it's those psychics that make everybody else look bad. I mean I'm serious. And these T V shows that's another thing that drives me crazy. Like Ghost Adventures, I call it, oh, it's, oh, it's a ghost, because, yeah, it's a ghost. And then you're, like, messing with them. 
And then you guys are just like, peace out. Bye. Good luck. How about let's like try to get these spirits to the other side. You know? Try to help out the homeowner. Try to wear something besides black. I don't get that either. I only wore this because it was like my only shirt I had right now. But. But it's just this. Uh, and I know people are going to hate on me. Because I'm psychic. I was born this way. But. Uh, don't ever embellish. Don't ever embellish things. Don't ever. Put your nose in where it doesn't belong. Don't ever just show up places when you weren't invited. <laughs> These are things that like, I thought people were taught, but I guess not. These are the people who when you're picking up your kid in the or dropping your kid off in the morning, you're like, and they straight up park their car right in front of the office and get out and go in when it says no parking and you know you're supposed to keep going. Those are those people. They don't give a shit. They don't. It's like, oh, well, I need to go in there. Yeah, lady, we all need to go too. <sighs> Sally, we don't have all day. <sighs> I'm sorry. I've been having a rough, long day. Um, but another thing people need to know <laughs> is you can't, okay. Do you realize that there could, that you could possibly be dealing with a killer, a, a murderer? People who murder people, they don't like psychics very much. Trust me. I've never said this out loud. But this is the year that I'm going to start standing up for things. See, I was working on a case in 2000, um, started 14, okay? In 2016, me and my children were victims of a home invasion. And they literally were like, <laughs> basically, just shut the fuck up, you know? This isn't a game. You can't just... I think people really think that things are like TV. You know, like... I don't know. That night changed our life though and... Um, still to this day, I don't work on cases like that much anymore if I do it's in another state because I mean those people the best they did in my house they, they know where they know where we live they know where my kids go to school you know and you feel like you have a obligation to the spirit or to the person that you're you know trying to help in the family and then you also have, you know, total, I mean, they're your, they're your kids, you know. So, um, sorry. But, so when people are just, oh, I called TBI with this tip. Dude, okay, for one, make sure that shit's valid. Don't just call them because you're, those apps, they do say a lot that's real, but don't just call them because, like, your app said. Okay. Oh my God. And I totally get, I totally, totally, totally get why people don't believe. I do. <laughs> because like, nine out of ten people I look at, I'm like, oh, they're freaking, they're full of shit. You know? <sighs> So, I mean, why would somebody just want to believe you? Unless you have a good track record. Unless... See, if you're working on a case, you're not posting it on Facebook and live and 
making YouTubes about it, like, on scene. Do you think the captain, or do you think, like, whoever's in charge of this? Hey, hey fans, like, do you realize a little five-year-old girl is missing? And everyone's fucking around, everyone's playing around, they think it's just, like, it's... All this energy needs to be put into finding Summer, praying for her, because God forbid, I mean, look, her family is even like, well, she was great, well, she was, even, they weren't, were anything, they still are. It's just like really, it gets to me. Because there's so many embellishers and fakers and, I mean, not to be rude, but anybody can do a cart like a palm reading. That one, someone else Anybody can watch a couple YouTube videos. You know, do some cards, pull some cards. You know, everyone can be a dealer at a freaking casino too. I'm just saying, like, I don't know. It's like it took me so long to come out and to be like proud of being psychic and like being able to stand behind what I say or. You know, I'm feeling confident. And then these freaking idiots, dude. Like, seriously, you guys, come on. This one lady is trying to talk to Rose. And she's like, Rose, her, like, her. You need to get the people's name right. You need to get their name right. I mean, even the spirits are getting pissed at her. They're like, this is true. And then I was really into that one lady for a little bit, but then she started seriously calling the neighbors. And that old man was just like, telling her his deep, dark secrets. And I doubt he knew that he was being recorded and gonna be on YouTube. <laughs> These are like people that are gonna be living there forever. Like, that their families have lived in that area since the beginning, including Dawn's. Don's real last name is Simon Wells, so I don't know. I'm I don't want to get into it. I'm just saying people need to look into the land records, but that's a whole other thing. I right now I'm talking about people not being genuine and uh, a little crazy actually. So I think I covered almost everything. Um, if you want to talk shit, go ahead. I'll, I'll have a psychic off anytime you want. No tools required, needed. I mean, sorry. I'm just like, wow. Just please. Like, we can't just. I can't buy an outfit and say I'm a fashion designer. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, and the ones who do actually work on cases and are actually involved in things, they don't post it on Facebook or YouTube because they get in big trouble. So, I'm just going to be waiting for her to get arrested because can't be going poking around, looking down people's wells and shit, inviting yourself places, that's just weird. Those are like the people who just don't leave, who are like, you need to go, and they're like, I'm not leaving. Like, I'm, 
go. Nobody wants you. But when I say things like that, I'm a hater. So when I try not to be a hater, but it's just really true. Like, come on, dude. Like, I don't get what you're trying to do. That takes balls. <laughs> that takes balls to, like, <laughs> to go to freaking Tennessee and just, like, Oh man, <laughs> it's kind of funny. Oh, but anyways, I hope everyone has a great night and like and subscribe or don't. I'm just gonna start being honest and calling people out because he's wannabes and he's like weirdo. Like I'm sorry, but you're making everybody else just real bad. So, anyways, have a good night. Like and subscribe because I'll be forever.